Turning now to breaking news in the Bronx tonight where a man was stabbed in the head on a city bus as it was moving. CBS News' Derek Waller live in Fordham tonight with an update. Derek. Maurice, this is such a busy area, really any time of day. East Fordham Road, right by Marion Avenue. Now, that bus was towed away across the street a short time ago after a 60-year-old man was stabbed in the head with a screwdriver. We can show you some video of what the scene looked like earlier this afternoon. This is around 2.10 this afternoon. First responders called to that stabbing on board a moving BX-22 bus. A 60-year-old 60, a man was stabbed in the head with a screwdriver by a fellow passenger. That's according to police. They also say uh, that the victim uh, may have been clapping his hands and possibly playing drums on the bus when he was stabbed. That's how that altercation started. It ended with that victim getting stabbed, taken to St. Barnabas Hospital, where he was listed in stable condition. Now, a woman who rushed over to help told us uh, the man lost a lot of blood, but was conscious and alert. Uh, he was bleeding a lot. I actually have a video of him bleeding. He was bleeding like crazy. And he was talking. He was the people was asking him how old he is because they was calling the ambulance and there was he was like conscious of what was happening. And thank goodness that he was conscious, alert when this happened. He's being treated at the hospital. Uh, the bad news, though, is that the man who stabbed the other man with the screwdriver, he got off that bus and made a run for it. Police are still looking for him tonight. Reporting live here in the Fordham section of the Bronx, I'm Derek Waller, CBS 2 News. Okay, Derek, thank you.